Hey, what's going on everybody? British DX Gamer here and welcome back to my Crash Bandicoot 2 Platinum Trophy Guide. Today we are on part 32. I will be completing Night Fight, the third level of Warp Room 5. There are two clear gems in this level, one from the death route and one from breaking all the crates in the level. Along with a crystal, I will get all of that in one run. So very early on the level here is the death route. As soon as I get the clear gem, I will go ahead and die. There are two crates in this death route, but I can backtrack as there is a way to get them without finishing the death route. When finishing the bonus round, make sure you have 20 out of 29 crates because the other 9 will be nitro crates. So, as I mentioned, we left behind 2 crates in the death route, but if this allows us to go backwards, and all we have to do is jump past those two holes and here are the two crates so once we do break those we can go ahead and continue on with the level As I'm finishing up the level, I should have 34 out of 46, and I do. Spinning on that nitro crate gives us our 12 remaining crates. So we do get both clear gems and the crystal in night flight while doing it in one run. In my next video, I'll be completing the second jetpack level, which is the fourth level of Warp Room 5, and it's called Pack Attack. There is only one clear gem along with a crystal. As always, I have some crash playlists for you at the end of my video. A 105% Platinum Trophy Guide for the first Crash Bandicoot. And then my ongoing Crash Bandicoot 2 102% Platinum Trophy Guide. And on the bottom right, all the Platinum Relics in the Time Trials for Crash 1. Make sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. I will see you in my next video, so until then. Take care and...